I'm in the forest, beautiful old forest there. See if I can find some birds to photograph. Either a dipper at the river here, gray wagtail, whatever bird I can find actually. I just needed to be out and uh, enjoy this great summer warmth that has arrived in my country. Just gonna see whatever can, uh, what I can photograph maybe some cuckoo i know there are some cuckoos a little bit further up in the hills there so maybe i'll try that as well but first i need to scout a little bit here in the forest to see if i can find some birds around here I saw a wren juvenile in like a, a pile of stones. I think maybe they had a nest around this area here. And I like like this pile of stones because they provide a hiding place. So maybe if I'm putting up the blind around here they can be around this area here looking for food and if I'm lucky I'll be able to photograph it. I've waited here for half an hour. I haven't seen any of the wrens. I just have to patience. I heard a cuckoo. I don't know if you heard it when I put up my blind, but if I don't see anything here, I'm going to try to photograph the cuckoo. Thank you. 
There's a willow wobbler. There's a willow wobbler right outside. <sighs> Small but beautiful little bird. With the most enjoyable listen to that sound. It's the most beautiful song in the forest in my opinion here in Norway. I might be because it go listen to this it goes way back in my childhood I have oh, I have so many good memories of this beautiful sound here listen So I'm going to move all of my equipment uh, further in here in, into a field and hopefully I did hear the cuckoo around this area here so hopefully the cuckoo will come so I'm going to place I, I cannot see any of the any like natural perches for the, the um, birds to stand and look for insects on the field so I'm actually going to provide that and see if some bird will come out and use that to like scouting the field so I'm going to spend the rest of the evening in that field there in my blind and hopefully yeah it's gonna be something turn out if not this has been a great great evening even so with a willow wobbler as you can hear just above me here and uh, even though there wasn't too many pictures it's so beautiful to be out. But now, let's head into the blind once again. I don't know if you can hear it. But it's the cuckoo. It's the cuckoo. I cannot see it, but it's a little bit further. up a little steep hill there oh, I really love the cuckoo but it's so hard to photograph it's so hard the cuckoo has landed in a tree maybe a hundred meters from me. Uh, let me move really slow.
now I have packed my bag and I'm heading home to see if some of the images of the cuckoo was good. But I'm at, I must admit that I had tried many, many times uh, earlier this year here, but I haven't succeeded. And I didn't expect to succeed uh, this time either. And I just hope for some small birds and I did not expect that cuckoo there at the end. So that was really, really nice. I think the image is uh, good and uh, kind of different of what I have. Last year I got it on a stone, but now I got it like on a dead tree. And I think that was beautiful. And at the last moment it was kind of good light as well. Uh, it wasn't like direct sunlight, but uh, the environment was nice and soft, but with colors. So yeah, hope you enjoyed this little video here and I hope you will see you next time. Bye.